welcome back to SnowRunner, everybody. This is SE Sim Gamer here. Uh, today we are going to show you the location for the Tega Ray suspension. We have the Tattern out uh, to get to this place. I haven't actually unlocked it on the map yet, guys. But we're going to be going right over about here, maybe you know, in this general area. So let's get to it. Uh, how's everybody doing guys you know holidays coming up and everything else so yeah you know, looking forward to 2020 finally being over or not you know leave me a comment guys so, and if you haven't liked this video yet man please do it really helps out the channel if you haven't subscribed you can hit that subscribe button down at the bottom right hand side of your screen all right so from the garage like i said once again i still need to make a video on how to do that to get the garage down here in Zimnagal. i guess i should have pointed that one out and all we are on Zimnagal here um this is actually the gateway from the quarry. This is the garage. We're leaving the garage. We're gonna come down. We're gonna come across the river because I haven't unlocked none of this. Um, when I did the location for the Tadron, uh, you know, I suggest having a capable vehicle and all up here. But uh, you know, if you don't, you might want to maybe do the missions to open up that main road and if y'all watch me do the tattern you're gonna see me do this all right let's see here now do I need a winch you know probably not I'm not gonna get stuck this is for the sole purpose of not floating down the stream this will pull the tattern also down the stream um, it'll take some damage probably. No, oh, it did not actually take the damage. That's awesome. Alright, and so from here, you got the split. Alright, you want to go ahead and act like basically the same route as you would find the Tattern. Um, but I'm going to show you just in case you have not found the Tattern. So you want to come up and make the right right here at the split come over off the side now has some logs we oh, made that turn I don't think alright um, guys like I said this is some really thick mud coming through here uh, if you like I said if you do not have a you know really capable vehicle this could take some time to get to I would actually suggest if you haven't watched the Tadron video on how to get it, to go watch it. Because like I said, it is actually on the way to this upgrade. So, you know, it might be in your best interest to maybe do, you know, both at the same time. You, know, you can go pick up the Tadron and, you know, take the Tadron and go from there to get the upgrade. I mean, I had to fast forward through this part. You know, I had to hammer out. And this is just some really nasty mud through here. And like I said, it will take you, you know, some time to get through it. It will be a lot of winching. You know, so. So go check out that video guys, get the Tadron, you know, get the Tega upgrade, because that'll definitely help it out and all, especially on this map and all with this thick mud. Show y'all where we 
car on the map. here so what we're gonna do is we're gonna come up and make another right at the fork and all up there They know it's extremely muddy, <laughs> so I'm trying to make it easier. All right, so and now right here, we want to go ahead and make it another right. guys and as you see it just popped up on the screen for the upgrade discovered the raised suspension of course not available for this current truck and then show the truck list this is for the Tega 6436 raised suspension Guys, if you found this video informative, guys, hit give it a like. If you haven't subscribed yet and all, please do. Hit that notifications bell and all so you can get, you know, notified for the latest updated content. If you'd like to leave a comment, guys, please do. I say, let me, let me know, you know if y'all ready for this year to be over. I know I, for one, I sure am. Um, thanks for watching, everybody.